is inside the nozzle. All right, welcome to another video with Furnace Tech. So today's so, video, we're gonna show you a close-up view inside of a burner nozzle. So I just broke it loose. I'm gonna go ahead and pull this little strainer off. It just screws in here in the back. Okay, that's the inside of the strainer. At the tip there, there's another little piece inside. Let me get a little screwdriver and pull that out. My hand. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn off my lights and uh, see if I can show you inside of this with a flashlight. That way you might be able to see it a little bit better. You can see the little light in there. There you go. It's inside the nozzle. Okay. So this is the piece that came out from inside of the nozzle tip. You'll notice this piece here is in two pieces. See how the, the fuel actually sprays at an angle, kind of a twisting motion. See that little groove right there? That's where the fuel actually follows that path that's cut inside the metal there and gives it a kind of a spiral uh, swirling effect. There you go, that's a really good view. So the very center of this is plugged. It kind of has a little lip on it. The fuel goes right through the center of this little plug and it comes out of this little circle hole here and then it's going to go through this little hole and then out into the into the combustion chamber. You shouldn't take these nozzles apart and uh, mess with them. If, um, if you have a problem with your nozzle and your burner, you should just change it. Um, all your trash is going to get caught here on the strainer, but if anything gets through it um, and starts to affect uh, how it, the spray pattern or anything like that, it's recommended you just take this out and swap it with a new nozzle. 